Yeah, it looks like we've got some cooler weather here overnight tonight and then a big warm up by the end of the week. We're going to be looking at highs around 90. So a chilly start to your Wednesday, but then by the end of the week, as I mentioned, it's going to feel a lot like summer. But when you know it, temperatures are going to go right back down here heading into the weekend. So these are your headlines tonight. Getting those temperatures into the 40s when you wake up tomorrow morning. Late week warm up. We also have some rain chances in the forecast, too. We desperately need it. We're running about five and a half inches below average for the year in rainfall here in Baltimore. We're going to get an opportunity, though, looks like this weekend, mainly during the overnight hours Saturday into Sunday morning. So we're hopefully that timeline there. We get the rain, but it's not going to be enough to have to interrupt your outdoor plans here for Saturday or Sunday. Temperatures right now at 51, so we're getting down there. Dew point at 30, so the air is still relatively dry, and those winds a lot lighter than they were earlier this afternoon. Northeast at about 5 to 10 miles per hour at the present time. We've got 40s out towards the west of western Maryland. Over on the eastern shore, we're looking at primarily low to mid 50s across the region. So here's your forecast overnight at a glance. Temps tonight again dropping into the low 40s here under a mostly clear sky, and then Quickly warming into the 70s here by lunchtime tomorrow, low to mid 70s. Air very dry, easy to warm up and easy to cool down. That's why we're going to see that quick turnaround here for tomorrow. Upper level area of low pressure that's been bringing some snow showers to parts of the Great Lakes and Northeast beginning to pull away. There's really not much upstream that we're going to have to worry about, at least for the time being. So no rain chances in the forecast here for your Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday. So if you have outdoor plans, things you need to get done outside, not going to have to worry about any rainfall. But again, those temperatures are going to be cranking up over the next few days. And it looks like it's going to start getting more humid on Friday. That's when you're really going to notice it. A few more clouds in the forecast. But notice here out towards the west, out towards the left here in parts of Ohio, that's the cold front that's going to be making its way into our region here for the first part of the weekend. Look at these high temperatures here, getting up to 75 tomorrow, 86 Thursday, 89. That would be a record on Friday. Then cooling right back down into the 60s here. It looks like next week temperatures staying at or a little bit of below average here across the area. So again, your timeline throughout the day tomorrow, mostly sunny skies, 50s uh, after those early morning 40s, and then low to mid 70s here through the afternoon. First alert, 7-day forecast, again, high 75 tomorrow, 86 coming up on Thursday. That 89 would be a record. Staying dry, though, for uh, looks like the first part of the weekend. Rain's not going to come in, though, looks like until later Saturday, so Saturday night into Sunday morning, and then cooling off after that in the next week. Okay.